promise, let's get our first guest on the show. NBCC, well, they won a number of orders in the last month while also monetizing part of its real estate portfolio. Mr. Pawan Kumar Gupta, the chairman and MD of the company, joins us on the show. Hi, Mr. Gupta. Thanks so much for speaking to us here at CNBC TV 18. Well, before we get to your order wins as well as your asset monetization, I wanted an update on your Amrapali uh, project. How many of those houses have been handed over? How many of them are ready? And also, what is the target for FY24? Uh, regarding Amrapali, things are uh, looking out very, very positive. Uh, here I would like to tell you about uh, one uh, judgment given by Honorable Supreme Court day before yesterday only, uh, in which uh, they have directed NBCC to submit the plans for construction of houses on the vacant FAR. Within, uh, these FAR uh, are, is of the area of about uh, 17 lakh square meter uh, in seven different projects. And uh, they have asked the NBCC to prepare the plan and submit to Noida Authority within 15 days. And Noida Authority has also been directed to uh, approve these plans in another 15 days. Uh, okay. uh, so uh, after that, uh, the Honorable Court will give uh, the final decision about uh, uh, this. And uh, NBCC is, uh, uh, will have a business of around 7,000 to 8,000 crore uh, for construction of these houses. And the total sale value of these houses will be around uh, maybe in the range of 15,000 crore plus. What so about Amrapali, sir? Uh, this is about Amrapali only. Okay, and, number of flats, uh, sir. No, number of flats, yeah, you know, last is, time you had... This is the additional to uh, what I've been going on now. Now okay. I'll come to going on. Uh, the, uh, we got the order for construction of, uh, for finishing 46,000 houses in 24 number of projects. We started the work in all uh, 24 projects. Two projects were completed and handed over to mm. uh, home buyers completely. Yeah. Okay. And uh, work is going on in uh, all balanced projects. Uh, 3,000 houses have been uh, handed over to home buyers, new houses. And 8,000 houses have been completed total. So balance 5,000 houses are in the process of uh, handing over to the home buyers. Uh, in, okay. uh, some, this is the position okay. of uh, All right. Um, your target was by end of 2024. You expect the project to probably have 46,000 houses um, that you are you're going to be signing or completion. Uh, is yes. that target still intact? Yes, target is still intact. Uh, we have already done 50% of the work. Total cost of the uh, project is around 8,000 crore. 4,000 crore worth of work has already been completed and uh, balance 4,000 worth of work will be completed by the end of financial year, by, by the end of 24, calendar year. You said, you said there's an additional potential of revenue coming in from the project. Uh, you've indicated that maybe in 2024, you'd probably accrue 2,700 to 2,800 crores from the Amra Pali project. Now with this additional revenue potential, what is the revenue accretion that we could work with in terms of a peak estimate from the project and by when? In the year, uh, uh, these projects, uh, these new projects can start in another period of four months after the planning and tendering process is done. Uh, and uh, uh, in the financial year 23-24, we can have the uh, uh, about 1500 crores from these uh, revenue from these new projects. And uh, in uh, next year, it can be around 2,000 to 2,500 crores. That can be additional to what has been planned earlier. Okay, all right. Uh, you know, Mr. Gupta, I also wanted to ask you about your monetization plans. I think you had a big pipeline. You were talking about, I think, 20,000 crores odd. But the last updated number that I have is around 5,000 crores. So what is your asset monetization plans? Could you give us an update? How much have you done? And how much are you likely to do? in uh, FI24? Uh, in our landmark project of uh, World Trade Center, uh, where the market value is around 12,000 crore, we have already sold more than 50% of the project. And balance 50% of the project uh, uh, will be sold because the project is nearing completion. So in 23, 24, we'll be able to sell the balance 50% uh, of the project. We have got many queries already. And uh, this, uh, we have another project in Sarojini Nagar, downtown 
Sarojini uh, Nagar. Uh, market value of that project is uh, 1300 crore. And uh, we have put up that project for, for bulk sale. Uh, in fact, the advertisement is uh, already out in the newspapers and on the website. Mm -hmm. So uh, these projects are likely to be sold in financial year 23 24. Okay. So, so then that would be, sir, 6,000 crores from your World Trade Center project because 6,000 has already been accounted for, plus this uh, yeah. other project, that is a Sarojini Nagar, so around 7,500 crores more. Yes, yes. Okay. okay. Uh, can you tell us about this latest project that you've won uh, worth around 146 odd crores um, in West Bengal? Can you give us a sense in terms of when you would start uh, work on it execution of the project and what kind of margins will you accrue? No, we have already started uh, uh, preparation of plans this project and uh, the execution will start in another three months after the approval of design drawing and planning. Three, three and a half months we'll be able to uh, put the okay. project in by construction to start. All right, sir, it is also the end of the fiscal. So if we could just get a housekeeping check in terms of where you're ending your order book, how much are you executing from that order book? Uh, we have an order book of around 48,000 crore as of now. Hmm. Uh, already the tenders worth rupees 4,100 have been opened, they are, uh, have been floated, uh, and they are in different stages of opening. And uh, mm -hmm. we are uh, will we'll be floating another 3,000 crore worth of tenders during the month of April. So uh, now uh, all the problems with the, our 7 GAPRA project is, are already over. Uh, uh, we have got uh, necessary approvals. Uh, mm. So we're taking up uh, and with the uh, monetization of the World Trade Center and downtown, the mm. 7 GAPRA project will go with high speed. And okay. uh, with more orders flowing in, the, uh, a few big orders are in pipeline. Uh, Kerala Housing Board uh, is giving order for redevelopment of three of their uh, big size floors in the state of Kerala. So that mm -hmm. will bring the price of around 2,000 crore. We okay. have already signed an MOU with the uh, Jambia uh, for construction mm -hmm. of their social housing uh, projects. Hopefully, uh, 2023 24 we should be able to take that for also forward. Got it. All right. Final question uh, then, Mr. Gupta, before we let you go. What is the execution plan? It's good to see a big order book and, uh, you know, directionally you're moving in the, uh, in the right way. But what kind of a revenue number can you guide, both for FY24 and FY25? And what kind of EBITDA margins? Gross margins, I think you're targeting around 8%. What kind of EBITDA margins are you looking at? EBITDA margin will remain around 5%. Uh, okay. It uh, can slightly increase from 5%, 5, 5.5%. 5 and as far as the revenue is concerned, earlier we uh, had planned around 10 to 10 and a half thousand. But with more orders coming in and all approvals coming in, uh, we are targeting around 12,000 crore on the consolidated basis in financial year 24. And in financial year 25, it should be another uh, increase of 20%. So that will be the peak for all the projects. Oh, <laughs> okay. All right, so we're going to leave it on that note. Thanks very much for joining in and speaking with us. So that's NBCC. Stock has done well in the past couple of months. Stock is marginally higher today. With that, it's a wrap on Chartbusters.